It's hard. It's hard to speak about it. It's very hard to go through it. Survivors of the Twin Parks Northwest fire gathered at the Davidson Community Center Sunday afternoon, including Sue Pope. She lived in apartment 3B. A lot of things that are being done for us, the families are not receiving. A lot of families that I speak to who work, who do not receive any government funding, are not being helped. Millions of dollars have been raised for these families, and that money will be distributed through the city and state. But it's taking some time, and these residents say they need help now. We are here for one purpose, and that is to offer the victims of the fire our support. The same support that they offer us day to day in our small businesses. A coalition of local businesses raised more than $100,000 to help residents with urgent needs. Prepaid cards were handed out today, $500 per person and up to $2,500 a family. Many fire survivors must rebuild their lives and start from scratch, replace everything they own because it was either burned by fire or damaged by smoke. It's been two weeks, and I just want everyone to understand that we're working as fast as we can. And Bronx Borough President Vanessa Gibson, who you just heard from, she says the mayor's fund, which raised more than $2 million, the remaining money there is going to be distributed within the next few weeks. Also, the hotel rooms where a lot of the people, of residents of this building, where they're staying right now, that's been extended to February 7th. And the borough president says it can be extended again if anyone needs it. We're live.